welcome back to cad cam tutorial today we are discuss about how we get the real view in solid works or we are discussing about what is the professional graphics card for solid works many viewers asking how we will get this real, real view in solid works so i'll tell you one thing you need a you, you must buy a professional graphics card either for laptop or either for your pc so we will see what kind of professional graphics card available in market for solid works you can see this is the real view here if you will select real view graphics card uncheck now see there is no real view so you must buy a professional graphics card if we apply here any scene let's see metal now this is chrome finish see let's say polished brass it looks see brass polished brass polished copper so this all depends upon your graphics card be remember nvidia gtx card not support for real view graphics so let's see what kind of graphics card available in market so let's go to google and here search graphics i already search graphics card for solid works now this is the graphics card driver and hardware system select okay now here this is the web website of solid works now here we will see what kind of graphics card suitable for solid works so solid works itself te tell you here if you want to select any model it will show you their graphics card available in which model so we will select here any vendor now go to graphics card vendor now here three kind of graphics card available in market amd intel and nvidia first we will check nvidia because it is widely used nvidia okay now here it is asking graphics card model so select this window and now here you will see there are many kinds of graphics card available for with nvidia quadro system see this below are the latest one see these are the quadro p60 is it is the latest one it is i think 12 gb or uh, 24 gb graphics card uh, this is also m6024 gb and there are many number of quadro graphics card now again you can select here amd now see amd also have many graphics card you can see you have to buy a fire pro series fire gl fire gl fire pro series there are many number of fire pro series it's up to you how many number of graphics card you want to buy and what is the capacity and intel also have some graphics card you can see here intel choose model now see hd graphics p 4000 p4 if p available that means this graphics card is suitable for your solid works if p p means professional if it is not available that means it will not support for your solid works so let's go to the website and we will search what kind of graphics card in solid works so select here nvidia nvidia.com i will select usa and canada and let's go to product S go to processor and select here uh, we don't want geforce because geforce is not professional graphics card just select quadro it is widely used graphics card for professional work now see now we are the in window of professional graphics card now see quadro products here you can find out quadro for desktop workstation for mobile workstation and these are for other purposes first we will see quadro for desktop version <coughs> now here it will show you what are the latest graphics card for solid works or for professional work it is not actually for solid works only it is for all the professional works katia pro e and sit autocad and animation uh, there are many works see these are the latest uh, quadro p6000 if you will see quick specification it will tell you see 
GPU memory 24, GB, GDDRX5, 250 watts. This is the latest, but it is very costly. Uh, let's go down. Let's say this 2000. Select quick space. space. This is 4 GB. And this processing core 768. It's much higher. It's suitable for graphics. This 4 GB actually I prefer 4 GB for SolidWorks because it is suitable for complex, so even for complex geometry. This M4000, it's 8 GB, it's very high configuration. K420, let's check. This is 1 GB or 2 GB. There are two options, but this is DDR3, not DDR5. Let's check previous generation here. These are the previous generation graphics card M6000, K6000. This K series is previous generation and if you will see here M series it is the latest generation. This is M2000, M4000, M5000 and 6000. Uh, let's go back and we will see what kind of graphics card for laptops. See here Cordro for mobile workstation, select this. Now here you will find the multiple number of graphics card for laptops. Here you can see Cordro P5000, 4000, P3000, M22000. These are the latest graphics card for laptop hardwares. You can see here 1 GB, 2 GB, 4 GB. I am using old generation, not this generation. Select here previous mobile GPU cards. Uh, I think my card is before that this previous generation also. But you can see here 2 GB, 2 GB, up to 8 GB professional cards available for laptops. 15.5 and 17.3. Uh, okay, this is my, I am using K. 1100M. This is only 2 GB graphics card, 384 cores, and this is DDR5, 128 bit. So it is also suitable for me, but this is not for most complex st structures. For complex structure, you need to buy at least minimum 4 GB. So these are the NVIDIA cards. Let's see what are the AMD cards. Select here AMD. Okay. Select here AMD graphics processor. Now just select go to product and here you will find professional GPUs. These all are the uh, gaming graphics card, Radeon and this all are. Select desktop workstation graphics. Okay. Now this is the professional GPU for desktop. Here in side view, you will find out here Fire Pro 9000. These are the Radeon Pro, these are the new coming graphics card. But before that, we are using Fire Pro 9000, W9100, W8100, 7100, and the last W21. 100 this is the latest graphics but these are the latest graphics card this recently launched radeon this is actually suitable see it is world fastest low profile workstation graphics card it is suitable i think for both but we will discuss about previous generation the, see this is the amd fire pro w9000 and this is the choice Six, uh, we have two choices here, 16 GB and 32 GB, but this is the high-end graphics card from AMD. You can see here below that W8100, this is also 8 GB, and this is also very high configuration card. So there are many number, if we will come down and we will see the lowest one. This is the 2 GB DDR3. AMD Fire Pro W9000 
2100 this is the low profile amd card but this is also suitable for solid works so i hope you guys understand what kind of graphics card you required for solid works solid works already told you see here there are many options if you want to find laptop select here dell i i, I want to see what kind of laptops available for workstation with workstation graphics card or with suitable graphics card which is support for solid works so let's select here computer model see this dell precision tower tower means this all are cpus and these are the precision m series this is the laptop i am using precision m 4800 now here it will tell you what kind of graphics card available for this so there are three graphics card available for this model amd 5 pro nvidia quadro k 1100m this is the what my configuration and k 2100m it is higher than me but this is also sufficient for me k 1100m so i hope you guys understand what is the role of professional graphics card in solid works and how and where you buy this graphics card and what kind of graphics card is suitable for solid works i hope you like it please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in solid works if you have any comment please write in comment box i will try to answer thanks for watching